Hello boys and girls and welcome to our children's devotion. I am very excited that you're joining me again for another inspiring story. Well, the title of our story for today is The Peace Dove. Boys and girls, do you know what a dove is? Yes, it's a bird. And most of the time, a dove represents purity, peace, grace, and many other wonderful things. Well, let us hear a little more about the dove. The little dove that hung from Louise's bedroom ceiling was loved by all of the children who would go to his house to play with him. They asked him, Why do you have this little dove here? Why is it so white? What is that in its beak? Louise explained to them that the white dove was a symbol of peace. The dove had a branch of an olive tree in its beak, just like the dove that announced to Noah the end of the flood and the beginning of a time of peace. I really like this dove because it reminds me that we need to live in peace with everyone. And that is true, boys and girls. It's important to live in peace with everyone. And do you know what peace means? Well, it means living in a place where you are not disturbed and you live in tranquility. Well, that's a big word. So, boys and girls, do you prefer to live in a place where there is peace and happiness or in a place where there is war and sadness? Well, I know for sure that I prefer living in a place where there is peace and happiness because there I am joyful and I'm always smiling and I know I'm always playing with my friends. Whereas in a place that has war and sadness, all we ever do is think about what's the next worst thing that will come to us or what bad thing will happen to one of our family members. And boys and girls, that is not how we need to live our lives. So what is our memory verse for today? Well, it's found in Matthew 5 verse 9. And it reads, Blessed are the peacemakers, for they will be called children of God. And that is true, boys and girls. And before we go, I would like for us to have a short prayer. So we are going to bow our heads, close our eyes, and put our hands together. Dear Jesus, help me to live in peace with everyone. Amen. And boys and girls, just like we learned about the importance of peace in our lives, I would like for you all at home to pray for children who are living in countries where there is a continuous war that's happening. I would like for you to pray that God protects their families and that the war ends in their country so that they can also live in peace and happiness just like we do.